Hello, Paul Hamilton here. Super excited to show you Playgrounds, the new iOS 10 app from Apple teaching kids to code. Let's get started. Let's create a blank or new document and create a blank document and see how this looks when we're actually typing code. I'm gonna double tap on my screen and I'm gonna write the words print. Let's see if we can get some text coming up. Now, when I press space, it automatically predicts uh, what's gonna come up, so that's pretty handy. But what I'm actually gonna do is get rid of those brackets to show you a couple of things. So on the keyboard, the letter J, if I hold my finger down on J and bring it down, you can see that I've got little shortcuts to different brackets there. So I'm gonna press that bracket. Um, I could do the same with the L, but it's actually a little bit buggy. It actually won't come up. So what I'm actually gonna do is hit the one, two, three, Look for my speaking marks and just type a little bit of text in. Let's go Swift. Uh, awesome. And I've got that there. And it's a simple case of all I have to do there is run my code. So I've pressed run my code. And what will happen is a little ABC will pop up. I'll just hit that and actually add a viewer. And there you can see my first code, my little hello world or Swift is awesome there. And I can actually make, if I actually touch my little viewer there, I can actually make that bigger by clicking and dragging, which is really, really handy in regard to as we actually build our code and actually get things happening a little bit more from a kind of user interface and having a look at how it looks. Um, so I just wanted to show you that because it's a fantastic uh, new application from Apple. Uh, but I also wanted to show you the blank template to see how we can actually write in the pure code and how we can actually view what we're actually doing there. Um, I'll also do some tutorials on the shapes and answers, um, which is pretty exciting too, and also the tutorial section with our character byte. But that's just a great way of looking at how we can actually write pure code um, and actually see what comes up with the actual viewer.